Hi again, everyone. So I'm making a part three. So far, there's a part three of this crazy woman called Girl Block. Girl Block. Forgive me, AKA Tori. It warrants a part three because she's just very, very increasingly obsessed with me and stalking me. And she spent a lot of time um, just dedicated to her negativity, her delusions, her slander, her lies, and the problems that she causes for people. I have now had over 16 messages from about 16 different people about her um, that they've had, uh, that they've been attacked by her uh, in the recent past. And again, I'm going to start from the beginning and show the messages and the interaction and how she's full of rage and psychopathy. Psychopathy, is that a term? <laughs> she's a psychopath. And since I've made part two, uh, the other vlog, another person has contacted me that she's not only uh, preyed on and abused um, children of a minor age, helpless little children, she's also abused a dog which is ironic because she's posted a thumbnail to one of her uh, videos on her YouTube channel where she's posed with a dog. She's also posted a video to her YouTube channel of about five years ago where she blows things up. So she's very, very, uh, she's just really sick. Again, her sickness is no excuse for her repulsive and uh, problematic behavior. She's also been uh, threatening, blackmailing, and harassing me. She's posting uh, new videos on me to slander me with her lies and post more negativity. And then she actually denied, falsely denied that she threatened and harassed me with that. And then I pointed out to her that she did it right here. Uh, she's also, again, been splicing and tampering with images on YouTube and then trying to pass them off as somebody else, um, me having posted comments that actually, in fact, I never posted. So this is one of her hypocritical uh, images right here. She's actually talking about herself <laughs> through her behavior. Look at this. I told her, in fact, how obsessed she's been with me. So then she posted this. She she actually turns it around. <laughs> she's a very, very rude, mean, um, nasty person. She just stalks people. Very jealous and very envious. And she's just, like I said, she's a sociopath. Very extremely disturbed. <laughs> Wow. Let's see here. She just talks and talks about me, cusses, lies, cusses, and lies some more. And if you notice, if you ever see her videos, I don't want to get her any views, but if you do go to her videos where she slanders me obsessively, um, she has kind of a wandering blank, blank look in her eyes. Um, just everything about her is disturbing. And... Uh, if anything else comes up, uh, I will post that as well. I'm posting uh, these three videos so far to show that um, modern internet and social media uh, administrators actually allow these things when they shouldn't. And, uh, you know, it's just wrong 
And like I said before in my previous uh, vlog about this disturbed person girl blog, girl blog uh, YouTube has become the uh, new gang wars. And that's just really too bad. I wish it was not so. Um, she looks psychotic. Just her negativity is, is, it just permeates everything. Um, and it shouldn't be that way. I mean, people go to social media to communicate, to uh, promote themselves, promote their businesses, uh, you know, have fun, enjoy. And there are certain people who just make it so bad for everybody else like this person. And that's just, it's, it's really unfortunate. I wish it wasn't that way. Um, these people, you know, they have no career, no job, um, no hope, nothing good, nothing positive about themselves, and they have nothing positive to say about anybody else. And it's, it's just such a shame how they attack others and cause nothing but trouble and spend their days and nights doing this instead of doing good things and, and talking about their own experiences and the things that they've been through and, you know, trying to show the good that has come out of their own bad experiences like I have and to, to, to inspire others and to help others because that's really my passion is to inspire and help others through my own adversities and experiences. And uh, I, I put everything out there about myself because I want people to know. I, um, I believe in disclosure unless legally it's not possible. Uh, so, but there are others who are the opposite. They're just negative and I wish to be positive. So um, I thank you again for viewing this and uh, hope that you guys have a a uh, wonderful rest of the evening and uh, happy Monday. <laughs> hope your Tuesday goes well and hope everything um, goes well for you guys. And if it doesn't, again, uh, if you are not spiritual, you might want to, you know, research and, and find out some about spirituality. And if you are, hold on to your faith because your faith will always hold on to and keep you. Okay, guys, talk to you soon. Bye.